Okay, we have wrecked one of their groups. Their leader is charging my dudes. Alright, well he did a lot of damage to him there. Alright, sending my werewolf guy after their leader, see if he can uh, do some damage to him. Send my leader after their leader too. What is that? Oh, it's like a hero unit. And he's trying to pick off my ca my one caster. That's not good. Let's slow it back down. Start. Uh, nice. Okay, we got their lord. Yes, the okay, where is Sorcerer? We'll overcharge this so it lasts a longer duration and bombard that area. in the wolves after that stuff. Bring us the carnage! Where's my man with that? Oh gosh. <laughs> He's chasing that guy. Mammoth, get up here. Now I'm actually remembering, I think, yeah, the skin wolves in this guy's army do have regeneration, but they don't have the horrible regeneration trait. That's only in Throg's army. I'll be there. So I need to remember that. Going now. Maneuvering. Maneuver. Got it. Which I think they're fine. Send the name of that for that stuff. Master's puppet. All right, they've got that under control. You guys come back and deal with us. Joseph! You back away. Them. You guys are mostly out of axes. Just charge. Just, just charge. Just run them over. Hit them with the meat. <laughs> the wall of meat. There we go. Uh, was this a city battle? Yes, it was a city battle. Okay. Uh, do I need to drag this out for regen? Uh, I can. I'll wait just a few seconds. Milk it just a little bit. I'm liking the Skinwolves. Pretty powerful unit. Decent attack, decent defense, regeneration, decent speed. Pretty good. Alright. Pretty sure... No, there is some still healing. I was about to say, I'm pretty sure they hit their cat, but no. There, there's still some healing. They're just watching the number over there on the left. Well, this is why they have times four speed. <laughs> this guy's the last dude. Dude, they're still healing. I guess these survivors were still damaged. Actually, I just remembered. I think if you end a battle, like you won't get back anyone that was missing. Like, it, like if you had five skin wolves and three of them died, you'll still have two after the battle. But the two were surviving in that example would heal to full health. I'm pretty sure. Um, so I don't think I need to sweat that. Someone, uh, someone told me that recently and told me uh, to only drag out battles if there's like a single big unit that needs the regen, or if you're bringing back people from the dead. Like, um. 
the heal spell, if you're playing the vampire counts, can bring back some undead units, like, from the grave. Okay, got a Razor Standard. Occupy, Coast Town. Eternal Challenger. Marauder Chariot for the caster guy. Okay, what do we got for you? Uh, let's get... Hunter Champions, what is this? Targetable uh, Hex for an enemy lord or hero to do a bunch of debuffs on him. We do one more... Buffs to Javelin units. Does it work on the horse guys? Yeah, it works on the axe throwers too. Mm. Campaign movement range plus 10% is huge. Minus 15% upkeep to the army means that it will we'll get back a lot of money each turn. So we'll get that. Uh okay. Let's see, missile resist, melee attack, melee defense. This guy's always getting freaking mobbed. Alright, let's get give him some melee defense. Okay, so here we got a pick for this wolf guy. Do we want more defense or more offense? Actually, he gets an aura increasing a stat in an area. So you can get more armor and missile resist in an area. And more armor in an area. Oh, wow. Uh, or do you want to have more attack and charge bonus in an area? I think I'll take the, the defense. Like buff the armor of everyone in an area? That sounds awesome. I guess that might be a good reason to have two wolves in an army. Because you could have one doing the defensive aura and one doing the offensive one. Not that they would always be in the same area. Okay. So, alright, his army is still full. And then we've got Throg's army over here. And let's see. If we take his werewolf and try to assassinate this guy, what is it? 62% chance. I'm feeling lucky, Chuck. I'm feeling lucky. You got this. You got this, Harwolf. Yeah! That person has been sent back to respawn after five days. Alright, upgrade training. And then rejoin the army at your earliest convenience. And Throg, can you hit that city this turn? Yes. Free win. Uh, also, we could put this on one of the trolls. We'll do that. And this is a city that's inland, so raise for the eagle. And go back to raiding stance so that our upkeep is decreased. Although we're not going to heal this turn, which is unfortunate. Upgrade the port. Upgrade the port. Upgrade this. And... There is army number three, which uh, I was thinking about just making a pill out of myself over here. Radiate in my own. My road is old. Uh, does anyone? I know your wants, your desires. I have a piece of Still, oh my God. Say them out loud. I need XP. My desire is to destroy you. Let's see, if I declare war, declaring war while having treaties or shortly after breaking them is considered an act of treachery and is condemned by all factions. Dang it. I didn't think that what I had with this guy counted as a treaty. Overrun the Fine. Let me live today. Uh, oh, he's expanding too. That's kind of nerve wracking. All right, I guess we'll go try to hit Kislev. Okay. Let's save the rest of our cash and end that there. Z, I saw your question earlier that read, Whatever happened to Xander the Mesmer? I don't know what you're talking about with that. <laughs> Xander the Mesmer. Uh, let's see. Confederation, Whistland, and Averland have combined. Okay. Uh, 
Okay. Alright, so... Let's see. I'm putting him into raiding camp stance so that his troops get health back this turn. Alright, these guys are going to head over this way. And they can raid it on the way there. Okay, and what is this one? What is this? Oh, Cultus Gold Camp. Nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Alright, and then these guys... Keep making their way over here. And got a little bit of money. I like this. Hey! The Beast stirs, chat. Okay, enter. Highlands Lady, I'm petting him right now. He's getting the look, hey, close up. He's getting the scritches. You know, chat, he has gone three months with my son being home for summer vacation. And my son was gone yesterday and today because his school just started. And Chip instinctively knew at the correct time to go wait and stare by the front door that Gabe was due home anytime soon. He knew. Uh, let's see, buff to hero actions for a while. Crimson Skull destroyed. Crimson's Crown found. Uh, close to having this quest done. Okay. Uh, raiding. Not sure what's gonna happen with it. This guy, I signed a treaty with earlier. I don't remember. Fly, Lord, I guess I have a trade contract with him right now. <laughs> but if I, I'm like raiding my way through his area, he's probably not happy about lucky that. that we didn't send you to parlay with All right, I'm gonna hit these elves on the next turn. I don't need to warn them ahead of time. Oh, I totally forgot, chat. This, I've got a quest I could be doing on this guy. Hold up, let me change stance. The Winter Tooth Crown. Win this battle to get your crown, which is an epic item. It says Valiant Defeat. I saved the game. If this ends up being stupid, we can control Z. <laughs> F5, F5, F5. <laughs> now, these quest battles are always pretty crazy. Like, it's always like, oh, reinforcements are coming from the north, south, and east, and, like, all at the same time. Like, this is never it. There's more than this. Also, pretty sure this is, like, four catapults. Royalty? It appears... Okay, we do get to... Alright, so there he is. And the scary thing is he's got Grudge Throwers, which have 440 range. Which can almost reach me from where they are now. How do we want to play this? Considering zipping over into the trees... The dwarves mock you from atop their hill. Kill them, but beware, the dwarves may have hidden forces. Alright, first thing I want to do is move into the trees. 
Dwarf Rangers have sprung their trap. Act quickly or all could be lost. Oh, look. Yeah, Rangers just swooped in behind me. If I hadn't moved, they would have been hitting my back line right now. This is a quest battle, so there's no survivors or, you know, needing to chase... Oh, my God. All right, so there's the grudge throwers. Oof. We are taking every one of those hits. All right, they lost sight of me. I'm wondering if they'll come over here. They saw me go into the trees. They think I'm here. I'm wondering if they'll come over here. I can, I'll just circle all the way around and then I'll have the higher ground. There's some more stealth troops right there. What? Get out there, man. Like I said, we knew they were going to have more troops. Apparently, it's rangers. Freaking rangers. Okay, you guys back up. I'm using the troops that have regeneration to try to deal with these guys that are zipping around. on healing. Dogs are taking care of these stragglers. Stromni Ulek? I don't know what that is. He has an ammo bar under him though, so he's something that has ranged attacks. Don't know what he is though. Vomit on them. Bleh. See, this is all a trap, chat. I'm getting them to waste hundreds of ammo. And I will I will heal through it. This is this is all part of my master plan. To make them waste all their bullets shooting me. <laughs> For anyone new to the game, that is a joke. There is a max to how much you can heal each each combat. All right, I'm gonna try to do the uh, the vomit missile again. Splash. All right, let's try this out.
running in now. Let's see if we did enough. A lot of their backline stuff is very low on ammo. And we did pick off a bunch of groups of rangers. All right, these guys are already low health. Back them off. The Horn of Karak Kadron. Slayers come seeking their doom. Oh, God. Slayers are melee units that do stupid amounts of damage. I'm not really looking forward to this. Where are they? Do we see them yet? I do not see them yet. I don't know where they are. Chaos Oh god, you guys should... I thought you would go around. Go around. This will hurt my king, but it will kill all of them. Oh, wait. I saw... F okay, I think the slayers are over there. to hit them. Wolves going to pick off some of those dudes. And birds these guys. You guys are low health. I would like you guys to back off and just recover. Uh, I think the most hilarious thing was that underway gobbo fight where you just had more goblins than they had arrows. We lost a lot of goblins that day. <laughs> A lot of not good goblins died that day. Oh god. I did not realize there was a group of them over there. Slayers have anti lars That's not going to be a problem. Let's see how this goes. Let's just use my asthma because there's no friendly fire with that. Uh, which troop is this? These guys, you can back off. You guys move forward. You guys move forward. You guys come back and hit these. Frog, you hit their leader. Yeah, those are the ones that are backing off. My asthma that group. The hero unit busy. Oh my god, Throg is almost dead. Oh my lord. Okay, luckily Throg, when he's panicked, can just barrel through all his own troops. Dude, he just got absolutely ripped apart by their level one Slayer Lord. Freaking heck. Okay, he's starting to recover. Try vomiting on him. My God's call! Quipsack! Magic 
mortal fool! I'm trying to just mob this guy. Cause he is, he is a problem. Their lord is Ungrim, he's a beast. Yeah, apparently. Armored, armor piercing, great axe, melee expert in defense against large foes. Which, guess what we are, Jack? We're a big boy. Pull these guys back, have them disengage if possible. I know you got charged defense against large foes, that doesn't mean you're immune to it. Also, here's some frostbite. Got him. Alright, cool. That was the biggest problem on the battlefield. Um, are we still in combat with anything else? Oh, there we go. Good lord. Dude, I did not expect a level one <laughs> Ungrim to come and almost delete my, like, oh, level 15 troll king. <laughs> he was like, yo, I heard you're large. <sighs> oh my god. Uh, luckily, regen be regening. That, that part was good. I should swap out these two marauders with more either skin wolves or trolls. Uh, the spearmen can stay. They were they were quite helpful. All right, let's see. 14, 15, 16k. Yeah, spearmen did less damage, but they were able to help out. Uh, Throg did 19k. Spell guy only did 5k. There wasn't a lot of really good pit of shades moments there, so he was doing like single target stack damage. Uh, treasury. Okay. So that in that quest, you defeated a legendary lord. So we actually got permanent melee attacks, spell resistance, and missile resistance for Throg for defeating a legendary lord. By the way, he was 23, not 15. My mistake. Winter crown complete. Winter tooth crown. Chance of intercepting enemies that are tunneling using beast paths or world roots, uh, basically going underground below you, to plus 10%. Plus 5 to the corruption in the area around you, minus 10% recruiting to your army, plus 10 defense, which is nice, and the crown ability, which is unbreakable to allies in range. Okay. Alright, and then we got this guy. And the charm shield. What is the manticore horn? Oh, that's okay. Alright. Uh, what do we do with you? Putrefying ooze. Alright, troll king. Primordial masters. Buffs to chaos dragons. We don't have that yet. Aura resist. Uh, let's continue working on this. Fuel by war. Then we can get spawn of chaos. Wait. This is not what I thought it was. Usually, on this blue row, the last thing increases your movement speed and reduces upkeep for your whole army, which is just really nice. This is the first time I've seen it be something different. We've already come this far, so I'll get it, but it's passive XP gain. Interesting. Definitely not what I was expecting. Uh, the armor thing. And... Hmm. Yeah, Ungrim is a, uh, AP magical attacks that are anti-large, so Throg is essentially no defense against them. Armor piercing and anti-large and <laughs> magical. So he just pierces through literally everything. Okay, more defense for our caster, dude. I like that he's got some defensive traits, but I do wish he had a mount to get around faster. Um. Okay. I wish... Yeah, I didn't realize how much damage I was going to take in that battle. I would have ended it in encampment stance, but it's no longer possible to do that. Okay, and then where's the third army? Wolfric. Challenge there he is. Undeniable. Alright. Thanks for another great night. See ya, Jackals. Have a good one. Of death. Okay, and that one. Uh, occupying because it's a port city. And what is this? 
Nemesis Crown Dig Site. Move your lord here to attack the band of unsavory creatures who have claimed it. Oh, that's where the crown is. I've only ever claimed the crown from other people. I didn't know what it looked like when it was just out in the world. Uh, what is his current armor? Let's take that and then put this on one of the others. Okay, and then Wolfric's army just won via auto, leveled up. So, more training. Looking good. Alright. So, all the armies have moved. Uh, we actually have a lot of gold. I guess from winning some battles? I'm like, where did this money come from? Upgrade the ports. Uh, what was this? Income. Okay, that's passive income. Do I want to go tier 4 with it? I don't know how helpful that is right now. Yeah, definitely go tier 2 with that. Tier 2 with that for the port. This was the thing that was going to give me Fimirs. Don't know how good they are, but we can try them. Alright, enter. Norska are like goblins. They steal their gold, right? Um, I think they're mostly, I mean, their units are called marauders. So I think that would be, you know, it incentivizes you to sack enemy cities and like raise them to the ground and steal money and not like generate your own from scratch. They definitely encourage that behavior. Um, it is kind of tricky though. What does this guy want? He wants a non-aggression pack. No, I plan on fighting you at my earliest convenience. No, 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 no. Okay, we've completed the quest, gained a substantial income. So got a few little rewards from that. Okay. Um, we're gonna go into raiding camp, so now we're going to heal on the next turn and go right here. Uh, let's disband those and get two ice trolls to replace them. So the troll king. I wonder if I should try this nemesis crown thing. Save game. Run him up there. Sign a yes to aggression pact. Close victory, but it says I'll have no losses, so I'll just hit auto. It's a bunch of goblins. Uh, take the money. Oh. Nemesis Crown. Um, Nemesis Crown, the only other time I've ever had this in one of my games, I think, was it during the 3v3, when I took it from the, uh, went from Mitch. So, if you keep the crown, all factions have minus 20 relations to you, which means you're gonna get hit from all sides. <laughs> Uh, hit points plus 10%, income plus 10% from sacking. Nemesis Crown ability is pretty nice. It's like a nuke, and you got a, it does a passive damage around you every second. So it's really good to have on, like, the Troll King, who could just get into a fight and sit there for a long time, as long as the Slayer's not on you. The other alternative, which is really freaking nice, too, um, your armies can heal every turn, even if they're in enemy territory, for 10 turns and you get a ton of money, and it's off the map so no one else can take it for a long time. Honestly, right now, I'm thinking more about sealing it for the money and the rapid healing and just getting it out of the way. Also, I think the crown has a rule that, like, you have to... What is it? You have to win a fight every, like every turn for five turns to keep it and then it grows in strength but if you don't then it just it like will leave you so based on what i know which i know is incomplete knowledge i'm gonna say seal it and just get it out of here so no one else can take it and i'll get the money and the rapid healing for 10 turns and we did get a bunch of xp for um Let's winning that fight. fight too so see right now it was just crazy amount of health back all right what do we got here uh, more ammo. Let's get the movement speed thing. To the four corners. The golden guy. Uh, scouting. They can run. This dude, twisted flesh. 
more armor around him. Fine. This dude. Norska. Northman come. Training. Okay. The eternal challenger. I'll handle Go raiding so that they get more money. No problem. Which is still weird. Alright. Um is that my last army? No. This one. Death. Who has never accomplished anything. This one hasn't moved yet. Alright, so now the question is, I do I pick a fight with Kislev? They are currently stronger than me. And they're currently very unfriendly. I mean, they'll probably attack me soon anyway. But we do have a, a ally between me and them. So, who knows? Maybe I can use them as a shield. Who are they against? The Ecstatic Legions. Uh, these guys. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Would you like to pay me to fight the Ice Court for you? He's like, dude, I'll pay you $2,500 for that. All right. Time. I know, I know. Five, five more minutes, guys. Hold on. We'll just let the, one more turn. Tribal fury. All right. Let's go in here. It's a hero. All right. Uh, why are we not raiding? What? What? I'm so confused. Why? Why does it say raiding is not making us any money? All right, if I try to assassinate that, 42%. I think you got this, bro. I think you got this. Get her. Get her. Get her. He hurt himself in his confusion. Bro, you were double that guy's level. It was an old man. You're a werewolf. Oh my god. Slaughter the sh The ice queen bows to no one. Not too happy about this, yet. Not too happy about this. I'm very confused why we're not raiding any money right now. Accept. In agreement. Like we're in their province, are we not? The eagle guides me. Alright, well, I mean, honestly, that army might get absolutely steamrolled in a second. I don't know. It's possible. Uh, what are these? Shaman sorcerers. Sure. Check the settlement. It probably got blown up. I don't know. Whoa, some random little dude. Interesting. Honestly, I don't know if I've got a chance here. I do not know if I have a chance here. She's got a bunch of armored Kosars, which are armor-piercing melee with special range bugs. They got guns, too. She's got a Regiment of Renown. She's level 29. I'm level 7. You know, this is looking really good. Can I get away? I've apparently... Okay, so now she's got two armies hitting me, so the situation's worse, I think. But I've apparently retreated close to my ally's city, so they're getting pulled into the fight. <laughs> but now it says it's a close defeat. Alright. This is going to be a long battle that I will probably lose. I am going to save it here, chat, and we will probably lose this army at the start of the next stream.